in Nugu, a pregnant woman was killed as a four-bedroom house collapsed in the Ologo settlement, in Nugu North local government area of Nugu state. Her husband and other person were injured in the accident. Mrs. Chinaza Chukwuka, the deceased, was inside the house with her husband, Imuka. Part of the hill behind their house collapsed during a downpour and pulled the building down. According to the eyewitness account, the woman was already dead when she was pulled out from the debris. The husband, however, was pulled out alive, but fainted later and was rushed to the nearby hospital. Also, Mr. Cyril Jaja and his son, who occupied two rooms in the same house, sustained minor injuries. Moreover, all their possessions were lost. Premonition the owner of the collapsed building, Mr. Joseph Nofamishielu in Ebney Estate, resides in one of the three houses he built in the same area. The house came down on Sunday. The owner adds that not long before the tragedy, he held a meeting with his tenants asking them to relocate to another apartment, sensing the building was in danger. A heavy stone rolled from the hill and hit the building previous Thursday, alerting the owner of the house. Mr. No says when he noticed this, he immediately called the tenants in the building, including the Chukwukas. The deceased wife, however, insisted they would remain inside the building. The owner went to his own house, and heard a loud noise of something heavy falling on the ground. He rushed outside only to discover the building had collapsed. One of the residents says the deceased pregnant woman was completely buried in the debris, and it took almost an hour to pull her out. Arrest, looting yesterday, the landlord, Mr. No, was arrested by the policeman from Ikelike Police Station. Before being taken away he said, crying, that, should the family followed his advice, the death of the woman could have been saved. According to the owner, the land on the hill separating Anugu from Nwa, was bought in 2011, and three bungalows were built in 2012. He resides in one of the buildings with his family, while the other two have been occupied by the tenants. Mr. No lamented that some residents of the area, along with some of his tenants, turned out to be robbers and rushed to the scene to grab the remaining property. Among the things stolen, no named electronic gadgets, and added that his son fainted after discovering the losses. Building on the hill before the houses were erected, part of the hill was leveled, so they stood at the foot of the hill. Experts say residents of the area are in danger as more houses could collapse with more downpours.